With the 2023 general elections campaign season around the corner, the National Commandant Peace Corps Nigeria, Professor Dixon Ako, is calling on youths to be wary of the antics of politicians who may want to be manipulative in the quest to win the poll by all means. Professor Ako made the call during the call's 24th anniversary on Wednesday in Abuja. Our correspondent has more. It is no longer news that the election year is around the corner with various campaigns and awareness renting the atmosphere. As expected, political parties would try to woo citizens on how well they would do better than their counterparts when they take over the elms of affairs. Appealing to youth during a public lecture to commemorate the 24th anniversary of Peace Corps Nigeria, National Commandant of the Corps, Professor Dixon Ako, says youth have been used as instruments to disrupt election processes, calling on them to be vigilant. We must all rise in unison to send a resounding no to any form of violence in the build-up to the 2023 general elections. I call on Nigerian youths to be wary of the antics of the egocentric politicians whose perception about election is a do-or-die affair and will always have recourse to the youth as instrument of thuggery and violence. This is the season that some politicians will place high premium on the unsuspecting youth and see them as the most beautiful brides, only to dump them after the elections. The youth must be wary and conscious of this reality and resist every temptation to be used he further stated that the aim of the Corps is to promote peaceful coexistence in the country, inclusive of youth development. The imperative of the Corps, therefore, is premised on youth development, patriotic services, and peace building through distinct reorientation and strict discipline. Former Nigerian ambassador to Russia and chairman of the Corps, Professor Steve Uba, says Nigeria is being perceived as moving to a failed state and appealed to citizens not to play to gallery. How will our youth be best guaranteed stable income, meaningful employment, and all other resources to maintain a standard of living consistent with minimum international norms? How will our youth be empowered to prevent the plundering of the nation's resources by unscrupulous officials who often act with impunity? The event with a theme, 2023 general elections, the roles of youth in security and peace building had dignitaries drawn from various agencies, from private and public organizations.